We're Breathe Carolina, and this is The Drop. Woo! Okay, so right now, I'm going to listen to Osmark Whale. I think it was a little long to get to the drop. The verse pre-chorus buildup was a little bit long. Yeah, a minute 10 to get to the drop, too long. Yeah, I usually want to get to the drop like around like- 30 seconds. 30, 30 seconds. 45 longest, I, in just our opinion. For a dance song. For a dance Not, song. It doesn't, you know. It's a great song though. It's a great, it's a great song. I yeah. would just maybe try to shrink the verse pre before it drop. I'm about to listen to Lander. This is Fair Pump. Yeah, no, it's really good. Um, it took like two minutes to get to the drop, which is way too long. The intro is a minute and a half long, which is, you just need it to be like 30, 30 seconds long. Doesn't need to be that long. Uh, the mix is a little bit thin. It could use a little more low end. Uh, it's not as loud as I would like it. I think if you mixed out of, if you mixed out of like a Kirby track into it, it would be like half the volume, it sounds like. Um, he should have used in the drop, in my opinion, a closed hi-hat, not the open hi-hat, because it would have made it a little bit cleaner. Um, the Hoover synth, like, it was a little muddy. Should have cut out the low end of it. Um, and then the break was a little bit too long. I thought it was going to go into the build-up halfway, like, halfway, in half the time. But it went like, uh, the verse was like double the length that it should be. And then the break, um, he like had this bang to the beat with like this hi-hat. And then it went into a kick came in in the first break with that already. And you can do that in the second break, but like no DJ is gonna wanna DJ for two and a half minutes before it's getting to the drop. It's just the energy will die at the party. So yeah, I would say trim literally like a minute and a half off and you'll be. Okay, I'm about to listen to Lunar Fly Voyages. I would say my personal opinion is it could use a sick vocal. It's really pretty. The, the chords are great. It's smooth. Um, take out the shaker. The timing was great. How it went from intro is good time, verse to the drop. Perfect timing for like a classically structured poppy EDM type song in my opinion. So I think the mix sounds good. The shaker thing just kind of throws me off because it's very predominant. So take out the shaker. Maybe in the drop, take out the shaker and find a sick vocal. That's what I think. But the track overall sounds great. McKinnell, 666. All right, hell yeah. Yeah, nice. <laughs> yeah, you guys picked the right one for us. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I already like that. Almost two minutes to get to that. So he pretty much wrote a song. Have you seen the movie Blade? 
Yeah, he wrote a song for Blade. Uh, <laughs> it's like, I want to see like blood. Like, <laughs> so this kind of song, it's hard to really talk about structure because it's not meant to be no, no, structured. No, this, it's like, it's this, just over the place. Yeah, it doesn't. Just tie, it's like a dead mouse song. But it doesn't like, need to be seven minutes long. No song in the world needs to be seven minutes long except for Bohemian Rhapsody. Um, but yeah, he could, I'd say he could cut it down. Um, he needs a new kick because the kick and the bass are the exact same frequency. So I can't hear any of the other frequencies that are in the mix. The kick has no has no top end and it has no slap at the beginning, so it's literally just like wah, 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 with like the with the bass. It doesn't make any sense. It works if you're making hard style because the the top sound is high endy and that takes care of the bass. But he has two things that are just taking up. Makes the whole it real bass. muddy, so you yeah. can't really hear everything else. There's no room in the spectrum. And when he goes into the the silent, it's like a silent preset. That da, 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 da. he should take out everything except for that, so it really cuts through and it changes the vibe of the song for a second, and then the bass comes back in. And that, but other than that, it's a cool song. We would play it if it was mixed a little better. We'd play it if we were playing like an after hours party. But yeah, and the fact, and he should change the name because it's a little scary. Six six six. six. I mean, it. you don't want to name your song six six six. It's like, just not marketable. I like being aggressive, but you never know. It's a little. It it fits the vibe. I'll, <laughs> yeah. I'll give him that. He nailed that though. Yeah. Don't come after us, Makino. You sound dark. <laughs> don't come after us. I've been doing uh, one thing that a lot of people don't do is I've been sending my my bass that has a lot of low end into a send with overdrive in Ableton. I don't know what the, it's a distortion plugin, you know? Gives but it's it like a- crunchy. Yeah, it's like a bit, it's a bit distortion though and I put it on a send so it's not on the sound, it's like on the send and it gives it tone. It gives the bass tone in the send so when you're hearing the bass, you hear a me the melody of it too in like the high end just coming from the bit and it helps your bass cut through the mix a lot and it gives like the, me the melody to like a really bassy song. So like in a, like our song Headshot, it's what we did on the bass, and it makes the, if it's just bass heavy in the drop, it gives you like tone to your bass, so it's not just like whoa, whoa, whoa. So if you're having trouble cutting like melody and tone out of your bass, that will help you a lot. I like doing the bass in stereo too, which has been kind of a new thing people mm -hmm. started doing, because a lot of times you want to keep it in the mono in the center, but when you put it in stereo and you do it right, it sounds crispy. Yes, it can also sound horrible, so do it right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, have do, you have to do it right, everything yeah, yeah. can sound horrible. Yeah. But it's a, it's a new thing that people don't do a lot. Yeah, but I think it, it sounds is. sick. Yeah. Thank you.